it's it's such a great scene. I, I love it. It's it's one of my favorite scenes of the movie. But she she lets him uh, in the middle of the forest near uh, this not pond but like in this small lake. lake. Yeah. yeah, where the the trees can grow and everything. And you have all these shots in the movie where everything is going um, not too fast, but you, you you see what I mean. It's it's very dynamic. You have this shot, this shot, and and then you have one shot of the ground. And you can only see the grass, and then the shot is extended, and it and it lasts longer than the others, and then you start to notice, you start, okay, something is happening there, and then you see the paw of the uh, of the of the dear God that we saw at the beginning in the distance in the light, and, and then we understand you, uh, that he yeah. is actually the spirit of the forest, the God of the forest. Yes. Yes. And as he walks on the grass, you can see flowers grow and, you know, small. And feign, uh, and feign. Yeah. So he yeah. creates and takes. Yeah. He gives He's life the... and he takes life. And there's the, the small music playing. And then when you see his face, the music stops. And I, I, I found it brilliant because it's... It's a shock, right? I don't know who... Yeah, exactly. It's amazing. I looked at it and I was amazed. I don't know how they, they drew it or, or what they did to the face so that it's it's so impactful. But when you see it, I, it's like the, the time stops and you don't understand what you're seeing. And it's it's beautiful and it's monstrous at the same time. It it, it left me speechless. That's, that's all I can say. What was, a beautiful was, yeah. scene, man. What a beautiful scene. And it's so well put together. It's just perfect. To be honest, there is not many flaws with this movie. And since I'm one of its biggest fan, you won't hear much <laughs> bad things coming out of my mouth. 